Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Now for today's video, it's going to be a DIY. Um, I took inspiration for a friend of mine called Diane who has got amazing style. I saw one of her jackets that she upscaled and personalised and I wanted to do the same with mine. So I've got my army jacket that I bought from H&M. I bought it two sizes bigger than myself. And these are the things that you'll need. A pair of scissors, measuring tape, needle and cotton, preferably the same colour. I'm going to be using original army buttons because I think it looks really nice with the army jacket and of course some Ghana cloth. You know I had a bit lying around and I thought it would be nice to put a bit of Ghanaian cloth on it as well. So first of all what you're going to need to do is lie out your item and just mess about with it really and just sort of measure up and work out where you're going to put your bits. So I'm taking the measuring tape and I'm just working out where I'm going to put all of the buttons. Now, don't laugh at me, I didn't have any chalk to uh, mark, so I'm using my white eyeliner. Now, the reason why I didn't use a marker pen was just so that if I make mistakes, I can actually rub it off easily and it wouldn't show. So I'm just going in with this eyeliner pencil and I'm just marking where I'm going to put all of the buttons. Now this is the most creative part and I really enjoy this because you can work out how you can put your fabric, where you're going to put it, how much to bling up and you know all those little really nice touches to make it personalised. Now the first thing I need to do is to take off all of the buttons. So I'm using the scissors to carefully remove them. And all I do is take the needle and thread and sew the buttons exactly where the original buttons were. And here we have it. I've got all of the buttons on the shoulders and all the way down the front. Now, with my cloth that I have, my Ghanaian cloth, I have ironed it just to give me that nice sleek line. And I've cut it down the middle because I want to use the fabric in two different places. Don't forget to measure up along the seams so that you give it a really nice finish when you're sewing. Now one little trick that I do is I iron the corners over to hem it so that when I'm tacking it, it looks really nicely finished and polished. I could have used glue, fabric glue, but I didn't want that crispy hard feeling to it so this is my best choice. And voila, this is my personalised jacket. It didn't take me that long to do. It's personalised, it's just how I like it. Got that little bit of bling and individuality. So guys, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Put it in the comments below if you do this as well, all these DIYs. And I will see you in my next video, guys. Take care, bye.